it's Xavier Wills here. Um, I haven't done a video blog in a long, long time since I was, before I was competing. Kind of got a bit slack on them, but um, I'm kind of here to tell you a bit about a bit of uh, different news actually. Um, many of you kind of like the last week because I haven't put up uh, Aussie Muscle Radio and Girls Dig Muscle Radio, which are the two main radio shows I've been doing through RX Muscle Australia. Many of you have been I've had probably about probably about five or so messages. Uh, just through Facebook and whatnot, um, asking where these shows are, what's happening with them, and stuff like that. It's only been really a few days, and um, basically what I'm doing is um, I'm kind of announcing, but I'm moving on from RX Muscle Australia, which I've done for the past two years. And um, while it's been successful, and you know we've got a lot of hits, done a lot of really good things, it's um, it, there were certain I suppose parts of a job in terms of you know chasing advertisers and you know, chasing up money and just. There's a lot of little behind the scenes things that I had to do that you know perhaps I didn't enjoy so much and there's I mean there's parts of every job that you that you don't enjoy. But um yeah, I just thought it, it was kind of time for a change. Um and I mean, you know, I was quite happy working with RX Muscle and being the editor in chief of RX Muscle Australia, but um an opportunity came up. Uh, basically what happened was um for those who don't know, I'm sponsored now by Platinum Labs. Uh, an opportunity came up through their business. Uh, I got talking to Matt and Terry, the owners of Platinum Labs, and uh, they were basically saying that what they wanted to do with their website and stuff, and that kind of interested me. Uh, I talked to them about you know what you know what you, we could do with that kind of stuff, and you know what kind of work they'd be involved with that, and I kind of fit fitted what they wanted, and um, and yeah, we kind of worked out a deal. It worked well for both of us, and um, I moved over to Platinum Labs. Um, so now I'll be working, I'll be the main media, I suppose, content creator and media manager and stuff of uh, PlatinumLabs.com, which is not, not known as that now. I mean, it's not known as a media website now, but, you know, we've got some great athletes on board. We've got myself, Amy Fox, uh, Renee Smith, there's, there's others as well. Um, and we're going to be obviously promoting these athletes, but not just those athletes, also other athletes. We're going to focus on as well, we'll do training videos. We're going to be covering contests like we did at RX and hopefully more so because the thing about it is that Matt and Terry have um, financial backing behind, I suppose, behind the website. So, you know, with RX Australia, if I was going to go to a comp and cover it, you know, it's four grand or whatever out of my pocket, which was, you know, a lot of money. Um, while I was making okay money, it was still a lot of money to take out of my pocket just to go cover a show. So, um, with that, you know, all that's kind of paid for for me to go do um, and I'll be able to, you know, Keep building this site, and you know we've got I've got some awesome ideas in the works. Um, we're along with Matt and Terry, where they're doing massive competitions where they're like ten grand's worth of you know an Olympia prize pack they're doing, all that kind of stuff. And that's the kind of stuff I want to do. And there's talk of um, a bodybuilding tipping competition as well, where there'll be a big prize at the end of the year. Just stuff like that that just wasn't possible. I didn't have the, the money to obviously put up the prize money, and also you know pay someone to create a database to do all that kind of stuff. Um, so that's something that we can do with um, Platinum Labs and that, that's what I'm excited about and the thing about Matt and Terry is that with a sponsorship, um, you know, they're, they're, they're not focused on just getting a ton of sponsored athletes and then just doing nothing for them or giving them wholesale price supplements. Um, you know, I get you know, everything free. If I wanted to go, go to the World Championships, which are in November, they would all be paid for. Like, they just, they look after their athletes. That's just plain and simple. We've got, you know, six or so athletes on board and they just look after them. And that's, that's what I want in a supplement company. And also, the two products, I mean, they have two products out. So they're two products, I've looked at the ingredient list before I even tried them. I said, what is good ingredients in this product? I tried them, I tried DEFCON, which is their pre-workout product. It's flat, it's awesome. Like it's not crazy, crazy, uh, overly caffeinated or anything like that. It does have caffeine in there and stuff, which um, I, I never take much of. So when I take my DEFCON one, um, I only take a small serve of it, but it works really well for me and I don't need much of that sort of products to actually you know, have an uh, impact on myself. So DEFCON one, which is this product here, absolutely awesome. It's actually, been, I think it's the number one selling pre-workout or it's definitely up there. Um, with the pre-workouts here in Australia. I think, it, I think it's number one selling and from what I've seen that's gone out um, from a platinum factory, it definitely doesn't surprise me in Australia that it is the number one pre-workout at the moment. And the other product, OptiBurn. This one is currently no longer available. So uh, the one you see here, you can no longer get anymore. Uh, there's one ingredient that was kind of, uh, I believe it was banned or, or whatever, just recently, so they had stopped producing the 
original OptiBurn. But um, you know, a lot of people say, oh, the new one's not going to be as good. It's actually going to be better um, because they've got, um, oh, I can't even remember in green off the top of my head. I think it's um, so citrate amped or something like that. Um, and basically it's, um, it's kind of like, that's the ingredient that replaced the other one. It's, a, it's almost like a milder version of DMAA, uh, which is obviously incredibly popular. Um, I was kind of talking to Terry about it, and he said maybe it's 70% of that. So uh, I think that's kind of the, the, the next DMAA, and apparently like uh, all these companies are just starting to get wind of it, and Platinum Labs are kind of at the forefront of that, and they're putting that in their uh, new OptiBurn AMP product that comes out very, very soon. Actually, Terry and Matter in America right now seeing that come off the line, like they've got video and stuff to send me actually the, the products just coming on conveyor belt and stuff like that in America. They've got um, actual video of a warehouse where their products get made over there. Um, and yeah, so they're over in New York, they're actually over there to see Renee Smith compete in New York Pro, uh, in Pro Figure. And um, yeah, so uh, like I really like what these guys are doing. We're also bringing in Prime Nutrition and uh, Blackstone Lab products. So you probably see a few of them up here. That's, um, the Blackstone and Prime Nutrition products. Um, these products are awesome too. And all the the thing I like about um, Prime Nutrition's products, you notice the difference in the in the purity and everything like that. And when you get like the leucine, for example, it normally leucine for people to know, you know, is very fluffy. It kind of goes everywhere. Like when you put it in tubs and stuff like that, it will just absolutely make a mess in your kitchen. Uh, the leucine is actually actually micronized, um, so it's much finer. Um, it doesn't leave a big, you know, a huge amount of like froth on the top of your protein shakes and all that stuff. So that's obviously a lot better as well. So I mean, a lot of their products, are, their products are pure quality. We've got one coming in. Um, I believe it's called Phytoform. Or oh, actually, don't quote me on that, but it's um, it's basically a greens and a fruits product. So it's a, it's basically a blend of those. And um, from what I've heard as well, it's the best tasting tasting one out there as well, which is. Um, kind of surprising because I mean you don't hear good tasting in greens product normally in the same sentence though so it's gonna be very cool when I come out with that but I'm I mean I'm incredibly excited and uh, I want to thank Matt and Terry for bringing me on board with Platinum Labs and there's so many exciting things uh, kind of in the works I mean I did a video yesterday with Amy Fox uh, I did one the day before with uh, Callum Bartlett who's uh, a Platinum Labs sponsored athlete as well and um, you know Amy's 12 weeks out of her first pro show uh, Callum's gonna be competing uh, in the NBA this year and he's got massive potential, just massive, massive potential. He's gonna be, you know, if he comes in condition, he's gonna be up there with the, the top natural guys at the Nationals as well. So, I mean, there's a lot of exciting things happening at Platinum Labs. There's new products uh, on the way, not just OptiBurn Amped, they're looking into, you know, protein powders and all that stuff as well. So, we're gonna be getting more products. Uh, there's a reason why their products are so popular, it's because they, they work and um, the formulation kind of thing hasn't just, it's not just a uh, chuck whatever ingredients uh, pop here and there. So from talking to the owners and stuff, it's, it's nothing like that. So um, very excited to see what's going to be happening in the future. Uh, stay tuned to PlatinumLabs.com. There's actually, we're going to have content go up on the site very soon, uh, just sorting out all the podcast stuff. So the radio shows will be up there. Uh, Michael Galley, um, Scott Goebel and Amy Fox uh, all going to be, um, all going to be still doing the radio shows. So you don't have to worry about any of that. We're still going to be getting athletes on there every month. It's not just going to be platinum athletes and stuff. So it's not just going to be five people rotating on the radio shows. Um, so yeah, it's just basically the radio shows are still exactly the same. They're just hosted on the Platinum Labs website. So, um, you know, it's not just going to be 10 ads of Platinum Labs. You know, we might put one in there, but that's about it. So um, for Xavier Wills from the Platinum Labs Warehouse, PlatinumLabs.com.